It's the day before the Dutch Mason Blues Festival, and everybody's working hard to get everything ready. Today, we're going to be talking to a couple of guys who are integral to making sure that the Dutch Mason Blues Festival sounds great and it's safe for everybody who attends. Tomorrow is the Dutch Mason Blues Festival. Today, as you can see, they're getting set up, and I'm joined by my good bud, Ian McClaws, who is overseeing, I guess, helping getting everything up and running. I'm the production manager. You're the production manager. So, how big of a job is it doing a festival like this? It's gotta be huge. It is. It's, um, the, the promoter starts working on next year's festival about a week after the festival ends. Yeah. So it's a full year occupation for him. For me, it's about a four month. I've been working on this for about three and a half months now, or four months now. Right on. It's, it's a lot of work. So now, is there anything special that you're doing this year, seeing as how we got the Blues Brothers with the Sacred Heart Sweden? What's, what's the plan? Well, if I told you, I'd have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's a, few, there's a few wrinkles and a few changes this year. Not a whole lot. Basically, what we're doing is the, the sound system has been bumped up, the PA has bumped up, uh, lighting has been bumped up, so the production value is a little bit better than it was. Mm -hmm. um, apart from that, we have a new set of bleachers over here that weren't here before that are not bought seating, it's just anybody who wants to sit there, if the seat's open, you can take it. So Sweet. there's a few things like that going on. Um, uh, not really a whole lot that people notice, just a whole lot smoother and a lot, a lot better sounding, a lot better light. It sounds like it's going to be a fabulous time. Absolutely. It, it always is. is. All right. Thank you, my friend. <laughs> my pleasure. One of the things at an event at the Dutch Mason Blues Festival is you get a lot of people. This is Dave. He's helping the Red Cross set up a first aid tent. Dave? Thanks for joining us, man. No problem. Thanks. So it must be a big job getting ready for something like the Dutch Mason Blues Festival. It is, but you know what? Um, the Red Cross slogan is preparedness. Yeah. And we're ready at the drop of a hat for every event that, that we get asked to be at. Right on. So when, when we get asked to come here every year, um, we have, it's all organized. There's a tent, there's a chairs, there's a first aid kits, our, our you know, wheelchair accessible stuff. It's all ready to go. And when we get the word, we just come and set up. Okay. Anybody, of course, gets a little overheated, gets feeling not well, yeah. needs a bit of help, you guys are here to help them out. Absolutely. In any shape or form, that's what the Red Cross is for. Absolutely. It sounds great. So, Dutch Mason Blues Festival, three days of blues, bikes, and barbecue, August 9th, 10th, and 11th, right here in Truro, Nova Scotia. Awesome. Thank you, man. No problem.